There are two types of buffing compounds. The first we use is a brown Tripoli. Here we're using it to charge the lap. And the lap is used to create a flat surface on the top and the bottom of the ring. Always make sure your polisher comes to a complete stop before removing any of the buffs. Each of our buffing wheels is dedicated to only one type of buffing compound. Our yellow wheel is for the triple E. Our inside ring buff is felt on a tapered wood peg. Here we're using Triple E to polish the inside only of a ring. After we've polished each of the surfaces with the Triple E, we clean off all of the Triple E compound before the next step. Jewelers Rouge is the last buffing compound, and we have a dedicated inside ring buff and a rouge buff as well. An ultrasonic cleaning bath uses sound waves from a small speaker to vibrate any of the debris off of the ring. A high pressure steam cleaner blows and blasts any other debris off. Now that our rings have been buffed completely, to a mirror finish. They are ready for final inspection, engraving, and carrot stamping. In this case, our client wanted us to do some specific engraving and customization on the front of each band. It involved three notches. Be sure to take several quality photographs of your finished piece. Documenting your work will act as a documentation of your progress as a metalsmith. Thank you for watching. Let me know what you'd like to see next.